prolific mean, emailer. You know, Craig Gowdy didn't email her. My most prolific emailer is the most annoying frequent flyer program that I have. You know what I'm saying? Like, I get emails from the Nigerian prince. I get I emails too. from people I went to high school with. So you you get emails that. from me, and I'm a creep. But right. none of us should be held accountable for that being an influence over our thought in a way that we're not allowed to, dis that we're not allowed to, to argue against. Lawrence O'Donnell. First of all, I, I know that same Nigerian person. I do, too. He's a nice guy. He's very persuasive. <laughs> do you think he has all You've that You've been listening patiently? <laughs> well, the, the simple headline at the end of the first three hours is, if this is all they have, they have nothing. And uh, we had every right to expect to learn something this morning that we hadn't heard before. These, this committee has been working for a long time. Uh, they didn't do that. Uh, and, and this is about the chairman. A committee operates under the authority of a chairman. Weak chairman run hearings like this. Strong chairmen get their strength, not by the toughness with which they bang the gavel. They get their strength through cooperation, respect, and open dealings with the other side. That's why the most important investigative hearing in the history of this country, the Watergate hearings, were conducted in a completely fair and open manner. And you can always tell how serious an investigative committee is. If the members are asking the questions, it's not serious. The Watergate committee, the special counsels asked virtually all the questions. Sam Dash, the Democratic counsel, became a star. Fred Thompson became a star, the Republican counsel. I showed an exchange last night that they had in the Watergate hearing where at the end of Fred Thompson's questioning, Sam Dash said, I just have a few questions because Mr. Thompson really did a fine job. I don't have to do that much. You, that's the way a real investigative committee hearing works. That's not what you're seeing here. We're going to take a break in our discussion. Uh, we will resume our discussion when we come right back.